Clarence Isle, here we go. This time, you see anything that you've seen in your local Walmart in this video, you're gonna have to go spend $10 in the clearance aisle. And you're gonna have to let us know what you got in that clearance aisle. For 10 bucks, you might walk away at the whole Walmart store with 10 bucks in the clearance aisle. If you like what you see, please subscribe, hit like, and the bell for noties. Without further ado, you guys know the drill. Let's go check out some lanes at Walmart. So I just opened this great value Walmart brand pizza. I already have the oven preheated. I go to open it, there's two of these. And guess what? They threw all the cheese, sauce, and pepperoni on the cardboard. <laughs> there's no crust. Where's the crust, Walmart? Where's the crust? I also just found out there's <laughs> two cardboard pieces. <laughs> they thought this cardboard piece was crust. What? <laughs> I wish this was satire, it's not a joke. <laughs> I really opened it like this. That's impressive. How the hell did that make it through? Where's the quality check? We know Walmart's very limited on their quality checks, but this, this is a new level of, uh, what the frick, Walmart? When your son gets his favorite stuffed animal stock on the ceiling in Walmart. And then you get another one stuff. FML. <laughs> Everybody knows the drill. You throw a football up there, not another stuffed animal. What the frick are you guys thinking? Look at this, guys. Walmart truck friggin' flip. Flipped over. This guy, like a dickhead, almost uh, cut me off as he was coming in. I guess he dropped off the load like an asshole. But look at that. You ever see a Walmart truck fucked up like that? It's crazy. I wish that shit would fall on my leg. <laughs> Suing these jerk offs. That's my ride. Yo! Walmart on its side. Tilted. Yeah, that's probably definitely. Uh, Safety hazard, I would say. There you go, tilted Walmart truck. The leaning tower of Walmart. Insane. Shit, I wish that would fall on my leg. Hit the American dream, man, if it fell on your leg. Sioux City. You might be 50 to 100 million in there. Dude, no way. Where are they gonna drop it? Like, what if you get a bunch of glass inside that drone drop? I don't think it's gonna make it. Uh, speaking of drone footage, here we go. The, we, we saw how they deliver it. Here's how it lands. Dude. Your freaking gallon of milk in that sucker is going to explode. If you need something emergency, I guess, like a real uh, box of cereal, maybe a bag of potato chips for the game on Sunday, this is the way to do it, but it's going to do some damage. Nobody wants your Walmart transport trucks. Walmart trying to scare these kids. It's not cars. That's Walmart. What the hell? Man, Walmart. Nobody wants your Walmart transport trucks. Nobody. Do you want to Okay. I don't. I have never seen this at Walmart. I literally go down the toy aisle every single time we're at Walmart for the kids. No one's buying at Walmart. No one's gonna buy your stuff. They, 
or forcefully have to go to Walmart to buy it because you guys kind of took over the whole entire industry. So that's why we shop there, not by choice, by force. It was at this moment that she knew she fucked up. Gotta get that weave on. Come on, girl. Can't be letting that fall off on a simple trip like that. What? <laughs> unreal. Dude, this is unreal. What in the frick, dude? Getting green bass at Walmart? Can't you just go catch that down at the local pond? Local lake? I'm assuming the HVAC unit on the top, somebody forgot to replace the filters over a long period of time. And that's what caused this thing on fire, but it's Walmart, you never know. Someone probably shot a Roman candle off in the middle of the store, and that's what started it. Walmart thief got caught. My boy, what? Best move, go out the freaking garden aisle. It's where all the thieves go out. Take it, take a full cart of groceries, whatever it is, push out the garden aisle. Just bring your own bags, that's that's rule number one. Don't don't take pictures of me, I'll break your camera. Mm, no you won't. Yes, I will. I doubt it, I'm 15. You'll go I'll to jail. jail. I don't care if you're 15. You'll go to jail. You, re you respect me. All right, and you respect me. Oh, hey, Ricky! 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 I will leave her otherwise I will call the police. Give me I my camera. The police. Give me my camera. You don't record me. I was not recording you. Yes, you were. It was uh, honestly, proof that we live in the simulation. This is a mimic of Matt Damon for when he was like 15. Looks exactly like the guy. Hey, man. Do you remember recording a video of me? It's already recording. Please quit with the fork knife dances. Dude, the game isn't that bad, but kids, stop going out and repeating the dances in public. Y'all, I'm not one to get on here and complain, but these are the brand from Walmart. Excuse my nails, they're ugly. Dude, I've gotten so sick this from This is the brand from Walmart. I opened a pack of these yesterday and it had something in it, but I just ignored it and I threw that one thing away, but I ate the rest. I opened one again today, same thing. So then I started going through all my packs. Here's all the packs I opened. All of these are unopened. They're not open yet. These are fine. These have fucking worms in them. What? One, two. It's not food dye, I've already dug one out. Two. That is disgusting. I have, literally I thought it's because I ate the whole box in a sitting. I mean, I'm pretty sure that was half of it. Maybe it was the worms that were in there, but I have literally ate these dirty things until I got sick. Check.
I give this video a 50-50 chance of being real. <laughs> Dude, the second guy killed it. The first guy, you deserve for that to land on you. You should have got the whole gallon dumped on you. Frankly, both of you should have. I think this is one of the stupidest pranks in Walmart. It just creates nothing but a mess. Slow and graceful. Guy probably wasn't even sore the next morning. It was just slow and graceful all the way to the floor. <laughs> Posterize. This is slam dunk material right here. Uh, Shaq, we're Shaq. We need a we need a score. Out of ten, what would you give it, Shaq? Go. <laughs> What? What the hell's a slooger? Whatever happened to freaking Stretch Armstrong, man? Now these kids are playing with weird little freaking goofy toys like this? Only at Walmart. <laughs> the employees are so used to this behavior. Dude, this is so bad. <laughs> and that ghetto freaking jumpsuit. Wear that thing to bed, maybe around the house on a cold day, but really out to Walmart? Mountain Dew pajama pants look better than that. Shit, even the Cookie Monster pajama pants look better than that. <laughs> yeah, I feel like this guy maybe hit it with his car on the way in, and to save himself the embarrassment, he's gonna make a TikTok about it. Can someone tell Walmart that that's uh, not a deal? It's actually the complete opposite. Clearly this was a big fudge up. But for inflation, it's not that bad. Have you tried the new Stranger Thing pizza? It's like a five. Uh, lots of matzo, number one for frozen pizza, hands down. In the Midwest, we got Giovanni's and Haggies tied for two. Three is one bite. Four is the mini Totino's party pizzas. And you know, this is maybe number five, five or six. It was all right, but for the price tag, not worth it. While at Walmart grocery pickup, Karen on the prowl. You're welcome. Mind your own fucking business. <laughs> you won't be ordering from Walmart pickup no more. Fuck you. Uh, yeah, I'm the right person to say that to. <laughs> well, I hope you enjoy picking up your meals from now on. Very rude. Dude, unreal. Hey, what's going on? Oh, what? Fuiste, verdad? No. You went. No. You went. Oh, shit, dude. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> oh my gosh, that's I, I feel like uh, with it being out of the scene just a smidge like this, I feel like it was already broke, but nice job you guys. I think you killed it. We went through some aisles, we saw some more goodness, goldness, and ridiculousness over at Walmart. That brings us to the end of this chapter in Walmart. And if you like what you see, why don't you head on over to twitch.tv slash realdeev. Check it out. Stream over there three, four days a week. I always have lots to do. Switch it up quite a bit. Do lots of stuff. But that does it for today. And as always, you want to keep coming back for more because you never know what's going to be next here on the Deev channel. Down the fucking redo. Beach. Beach, yeah. How about that? No, who wants to fuck with me? Let's do it again. It's fucking embarrassing. That's fucking embarrassing. Estas cosas pasan en la actualidad.